We now have the Commissioner for Information for Oshun State, uh, Funke Egbemode. Good morning, Commissioner. Good morning. Now, uh, let's go straight to the matter. You, the, you, Oshun State was put on lockdown for two weeks. How effective was that? Uh, I'll tell you that uh, the people of this state of Oshun have been very cooperative, largely. You know, no matter how well some people want to do, you will still find a few people who will want to sneak out and uh, go do their business. But largely, the lockdown has been very effective. All right. The new figures that emerge says that uh, Oshun State has recorded two more deaths. So what are the measures you're putting in place now? We are closing our borders. Our borders have been uh, policed. We've, we've done everything to keep people out. And we will reinforce that. We will do more. We will continue with the public enlightenment so people know that this lockdown, this sit at home, is not for Governor Yetola. It is for them. It is to keep the state safe and that uh, the uh, if we all comply, we will return to our normal routines quicker than if we keep disobeying and breaching the lockdown. All right. The state, your state has also recorded 20 recoveries so far, which is good news in itself. What is the strategy that is working particularly for you? Uh, I'll say that um, we have plenty of the grace of God on our side and uh, a very supportive leader in the person of the governor and very committed health officials in the state. Um, we just do what we need to do. Our call centre are there, so we get these cases in on time, and then they are given proper care, and we keep working on getting better with our treatment every day. All right, Commissioner, we've been speaking to experts on this matter, and some have confirmed, really, that we have moved into a stage of community transmission in certain states. Do you have any mm -hmm. such concerns for Oshun? Everybody is concerned, but here we don't have community transmission yet. Uh, for as long as our people continue to do what is right, we will be able to keep that at bay. And the government wants to ensure that doesn't happen. Mm -hmm. What we have had are the breaches with uh, people coming from neighboring countries, our neighboring states into Osho. And uh, fortunately, we have uh, people who are very uh, cooperative. So when they see somebody who just came, who just arrived the state, they quickly alert uh, uh, 293 and the health officials swing into action immediately. All right, you've also highlighted the fact that you have really committed health workers. Now let's talk about your testing capacity. Is it also readily available to the, mass, uh, to the vast majority of the people of Osho? Uh, we are very blessed to have uh, this testing center in Osho. It is located on the premises of Redeemers University. It is the only of its type around here. So we get quick turnaround at our testing. I mean, the, the, the laboratory where we go is just about five, seven minutes drive from the center of the capital. Hmm. So we have access. All right, Commissioner for Information, Oshun State, Funke Gbemode, thank you very much for your time and please do stay safe. Thank you. Stay safe too.